Right, I do one. Today we are going to learn the poem Eagle. The eagle uh, belongs to uh, Alfred Lord Tennyson and Tennyson belongs to uh, Victorian era. This Victorian era is supposed to be a tyrannical period. It was in uh, 1890 to 1892. Uh, the, in that period, uh, people had to undergo certain harassments uh, due to the power uh, problems. So, in this poem, uh, the low, uh, royal poet uh, Lowry, uh, the royal poet Alfred Lord Tennyson speaks about the image of a uh, eagle and it is basically about the theme of power. So, the eagle is the king of the bird and uh, this eagle uh, is very significant because uh, from this uh, poem we find uh, very uh, few lines, one, two, three lines and another three lines which is like a balanced position. From that uh, structure balance we can visualize the eagle's wrinkling movement in the uh, blue sky also. So, when it comes to the start of our discussion, he means the personification, he class, the eagle class the crack uh, uh, very tightly here and uh, with crooked hands because eagle might be uh, doing some uh, dishonest means and dishonest acts like that and uh, close to the sun it may be a kind of a hyperbole or you can interpret it as a kind of an allusion also in lonely lands. So lonely lands means it's a kind of a alliteration. So, it's, uh, so this uh, powerful figure, the uh, eagle, it symbolizes yeah. well air force and power and authoritative leadership uh, uh, stands in a lonely uh, way and uh, reach with the Asia world. So, the eagle uh, reach with the Asia world, uh, he stands, so eagle stands there. The wrinkle sea, down in the wrinkle sea, uh, it's a kind of a thing that we can interpret as common classes, common people like that, uh, beneath him crawl. So eagle uh, uh, watches this incident. So this crawl might be uh, symbolizing about the worms, uh, worms, uh, worms like that. Some uh, literary interpretations it might be symbolizing the old age because uh, wrinkles in the forehead may be uh, symbolizing the old age. He watches, so this uh, eagle watches this incident very carefully from his mountain wall. So this is a kind of a mountain wall, it's the semi position the eagle leaves. So from that eagle uh, survives and like a thunderbolt, so like being here is a kind of a simile. Uh, thunderbolt means a kind of a big sound, he falls. So he falls means the eagle goes down. Uh, like that, this poem uh, carries a, a kind of a, a setting where uh, the image of eagle is more powerful here and powerful images are uh, can be seen every line because uh, this uh, crack and crooked hands, these powerful imageries are there, lonely lands because if you can survive in the lonely land, you must have power. So it also symbolizes that each and every line has power image. Now here Asia world, so blue sky, so eagle can survive in the blue sky, so it's a kind of power image. And wrinkle sea, uh, so this uh, sea is wrinkling here, so it also symbolizes certain power. And he watches from his mountain walls, so this eagle watches from the semi uh, position in the top of the uh, uh, bag. So, uh, like a thunderbolt he falls, so eagle comes down with a thunderbolt for his attack. So, it's a kind of a small introduction for the poem, but uh, we are going to do some more things with regard to this one. We'll come a bit in another video. I go on, you can subscribe in the English Academy. Welcome, I go on.